Samurai. What? Samurai dog. The... Oh. Dogs. <laughs> it looks like. Wowzers. It looks like a painter's is... palette as opposed to a hot dog, but. Right. Yeah. Why is it blue? What? There's a blue. <laughs> yeah. Thing there. Why is it blue? What, what? What sauce is that? It's just like they've got ketchup, mustard, and bubble gum. Like what? Yeah. Are they... This is Gord Lake Wowzers. Yep. I'm not sure it warrants a wowzers, though. Probably not. <laughs> but hey, look at that snack stand. This text is really blurry. <laughs> samurai dogs. I wanted samurai dog, please. <laughs> I bet they're great. With a name like samurai dog, how could they not be? They're a little behind the times, though. The kids are all into the pink princess. Yeah, that's now. the that's the <laughs> yeah that's the follow up show to the Steel Samurai, and the Steel Samurai himself is playing the pink princess, which is great. <laughs> oh wow! Is this like Toy Story when cowboy toys go out of fashion? Yeah, a little, like, I guess a little bit. astronauts. Yeah, uh, yeah. Stinky Pete is just like <laughs> it's about princesses now, Woody. Children deserve samurais. You'll be forgotten. <laughs> You'll like Amy. She's a princess. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a Japanese fact. Would you like to hear it? Uh, please do, yes. Okay, so they have a thing called Children's Day. Uh-huh. So years and years ago, it was called Boys' Day, kind of. Oh, this okay. is like years ago, like decades ago. Yeah, like, and like to celebrate... 2004, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to, celebrate, um, to celebrate it... Uh, they have like samurai decor. They have decorations that are samurai armor. So mm -hmm. like samurai helmets. It's called like a kabuto. So um, on Children's Day in Japan, the decorations you see like like lots of samurai memorabilia and stuff. Right. So there is like there is a there is a s association. There is kind of an association with samurai decoration and children in some way. Okay. But I don't know what the hot dogs have to. I don't know. I uh, do it. They're delicious. Hot dog stand. <laughs> it's closed. The Christmas fringe looks a little half baked. The banner reads "Samurai Dogs." Somebody needs to redecorate. Okay, that was so necessary. That that rhymed. Huh? Oh, that rhymed. Did you. did you notice? I did not. But oh well, he winter does turn people into poets. Mm. Ah, someone left some poppers here. You know. Pull the string. And it goes, pop. Yeah, yeah, I know the ones. You see them a lot around New Year's. I too, I've got it. Oh, oh I've, it's in my chest. I think, you know, in the cutscene, mm -hmm. when it's like, and it flashes. Oh, it's a popper that went off. I think it was one of them sodding poppers. Would That's it what make... I think. So I guess it depends on the witness's testimony. Did they see a flash or did they just hear a sound? Because it would not make a like a vi like it would you know spring out a bunch of confetti, but it wouldn't be bright. But you would hear it. It would you if it was like a really powerful one. You could mistake it for a, maybe a gunshot if you weren't sure. <laughs> Yeah. Maybe. Maya looks like she's about to use one in Phoenix's <laughs> face. Yeah. It's like, hey, Phoenix, look. <laughs> <laughs> they might be a clue. Let's take them. Come on, admit it. You just want to pop them, right? <laughs> Was it that obvious? Puffers. Hmm. Yeah, why not? I suppose it couldn't hurt. Huh? Where'd they go? <laughs> Into my pocket. Good. A classic party noisemaker. Pull the string, it goes bang. Not very clue worthy. Wrong! I think you're Wrong. on something, Joey. Yes. I line up a plastic benches. I guess the idea is you buy a dog and eat it here. And not anyone would sit here and <laughs> no, eat right. it on a day like this. Except yeah. maybe Maya, if she had a samurai dog. She starts she rolling around on the ground. <laughs> I want a samurai <laughs> dog! <laughs> At least the place is well maintained. Huh? I almost didn't see that signpost. How? What do you mean you didn't? It's huge! <laughs> Left, boat, docks, right, exit. Okay. Lake. Should we go to the docks, maybe? Maybe. So. Gord Lake is really big. Yeah. 
Say, Nick, why is it called Gourd Lake? I bet it's because it's shaped like a gourd. Mm. Oh? Well, well a, a long time ago, they used to grow gourds here. Damn it. <laughs> no way. I was sure it was oh! going to look like a bird. <laughs> you were my ass! She is literally, you know when people used to have a literally me, yeah. they res resonate with a character. She is literally me. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> You know, like an hourglass shape? Well, it is shaped like a gourd, actually, but that's just a coincidence. Oh, okay. Is it possible you're both Phoenix and Maya? <laughs> it, as one. <laughs> uh, is there anything else to scan here? I don't think so. I think that's, yeah, I think that's it. Alright, so let's move. Can we go to the... Okay, so there's the woods and the rental shop. Let's go to the woods first. Ooh. Did, by any chance, this camera, like, capture everything that happened? Because that would be very, very helpful. I like it here, Nick. Look, someone's camping. What's that, like, weird, like, octopus screaming on the no camping sign? It's a fire. Yeah, no, ne next to that. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I didn't see that. I was so confused. I was like, Teal, don't you know what a fire looks like? <laughs> and I've noticed there is a screaming octopus. Yes, there is. Yeah, <laughs> there is. I'm not, I know but I'm the, crazy, but I know what like, fire is. <laughs> the octopus is looking at the fire. What is that? What, what's that huge gourd behind Maya? Teal, that's a car. Oh, I see. <laughs> They've got guts camping at the scene. Also, of a someone's there. camping here. Read the sign. This yeah. is not camping. It, I think to, to be fair, the sign is pointing the other direction. They might have missed yeah. it. <laughs> hey, Nick. If they were camping here last night, they might know something about the murder. That's true. Good call, Maya. Let's go talk to them. All right, well, let's see. We'll first examine everything. Car. This SUV has seen better days. Has it? It looks pretty immaculate it's, to me. It's absolutely spotless. <laughs> it's dead. It is not. <laughs> it's dented all over. It is the newest SUV I've ever seen. Yes. It doesn't even have any dirt after driving or, or sand, after driving through a park and a beach. Like, <laughs> this needs a product placement. I just want Phoenix to be like, wow, that Dacia Sandero looks <laughs> yeah. like it can handle all types of terrain. Really? A three year warranty? Wow, that's pretty good. Wouldn't you agree, Maya? I agree. Test drive your Dacia Sandero today. <laughs> not affiliated with Super Impressor, please do not buy that. I can't believe anyone <laughs> would drive their car down here. Yeah. All right. Hey, Nick. What? Don't tell me you're hungry again. No, no. I was just wondering, why are camping pots and pens made of alum aluminium? Did you nearly say aluminium? How dare you? <laughs> well, because... because I'm doing the voice, right. so I'm, I mean, like, I'm in that mode. Accurate, but, but for yeah. them, but no, don't you dare spoil the name of Alimini. <laughs> yeah. They didn't talk about that in any of the law books. So, there's no law saying they have to be made out of aluminium, then? I'm not having this conversation. It's probably because it's a cheaper metal. I don't really know. I would imagine that's the reason. It heats up quickly, it's lightweight, so yeah. aluminium's got lots of great properties. Yeah. There's food and some magazines on the sheet. It takes a pretty tough skin to camp in this cold. Can't read anything. It's... I suppose there's no camping. Find a place to, pick, uh, to pitch a tent. Wait, what if the sign said, no setting tents on fire? I don't think they have signs like that. Hmm. It's not, I mean, they do, like, any time you see, like, a crazy sign that makes technically no sense, it is because someone has done that. Someone has been stupid enough to do something outlandish. Oh, yeah. And it's just like, oh, oh, th those people do exist. <laughs> it's, it happens. The trees go quite thick here. Then the back, the trees fade into the shadow where the sunlight can't reach them. Okay, great. Um, Very poetic, Phoenix. Okay, it's probably this. because it's in win we're in winter. This camera has a mic and some sort of attachment. Let's take pictures when triggered by a noise. 100% it took a picture. Yeah. 1 billion percent. Thank you. Let's try it out. <laughs> <coughs> she just hot, like, spits up like... <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hi, I'm 
Nick. Maybe I'm not saying it loud enough. <laughs> hey, I'm Nick. Huh. <laughs> Will you stop that? Maybe it's broken? D don't kick it! Maybe it isn't set to respond to voices. Well, what then? These things? The party poppers? <laughs> what, oh my god! <laughs> Sorry, did a murder happen? Did the machine gun fire? What was that? <laughs> Why did it take literally 24 pictures? <laughs> The the, uh, the the gun is hidden in the camera. Yeah. <laughs> it responded. Uh, <laughs> can, you can be yo! <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, you! Get your hand off of that! <laughs> what in the Sam Hill? I... Look what you've done now! Here goes a whole roll of film! Uh, what? Huh? Sorry. So, sorry is nice, but it don't pay my bills. You'll know how much a roll that film costs. I'll pay you back. What are we all thinking setting off a party popper in a place like this? She gives her a samurai dog. And she <laughs> gives her. Yeah. <laughs> what? Don't try to play stupid with me just because you think I'm some country bumpkin. Yeah, I know how you all yanks think. I say those some folks talk with that exaggerated drawl, why they must be dumb! Well, let me tell you, just because I might be dumb don't mean we all are! Mm -hmm. And who are you now, a chaperone? Uh, yeah, uh, no, uh, rather, uh, we're sort of friends. Just figure out what y'all gonna say and say it for bejesus' sake. God, I'd rather sit through one of Papa's drawls and listen to you stutter all day. Oh boy, I guess we should pay her for the film. Watch it! Yes, ma'am! <laughs> On second thought, I'll pay later. I'm really sorry! <laughs> All right, well. What if she was um, Grossberg's daughter? <laughs> but no, no, that's the voice I gave him. I don't actually know if he sounds like that. Yeah. Whereas, we know she sounds like that. That's yeah. the thing. Uh, I'm gonna show you the badge. Well, here you go. I, uh... that, that's a pastry. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, uh, this is my badge. Oh, we sold those at the ranch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> huh? Aren't badges supposed to be all shiny and impressive? You copper sign? Uh, I'm a lawyer. What? You ain't gonna try and pull one of them lawsuits on me for that film now? Cause I have y'all know I'm a fighting, I wrestled meaner looking things than you. No, that's not it at all. We're here investigating a murder that took place here on the lake. A murder? Sounds cool! Why didn't y'all say that in the first place? Go ahead, ask me anything you like! Finally, some corporation. Was it you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you too. You can come out hiding now. I won't bite. Hard. Come to think of it, where did my get to? Sorry. I was feeling a little overwhelmed. The culture gap and all. What, first world problems? Well, yeah. okay. <laughs> uh, never, <laughs> what? Never you mind, honey. I can talk Yank if you, if you, <clears throat> if it pleases you. <laughs> Thanks. I think I'll be okay. She, <laughs> Maya is allergic to southerners. <laughs> oh my god, I love her name. Great then. I'm Lada. Lada Hart. But you, y'all can call me Lada. <laughs> I love I, I love her already. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here photographing oh media showers for a research project. Mighty pleased to meet you. All right, this is fun. I, I once came up with a character's name as a joke, and her, she she was a scientist. Her name was Doctor Tonin, and her first name was yeah, Sarah. Sarah. Yeah, and I, Sarah. Sarah Tonin, and I told her Neil, and I just started laughing like <laughs> an idiot. Because I thought, I thought it was so hilarious, and then Emil just went, Oh, come on, man! <laughs> he was like, you're better than that, come on! Oh, I love <laughs> and I, it. I rem yeah, and I love it to this day. So, uh, well, what happened, what happened? Heart? Uh Oh, yeah, when, I, when was that murder, anyway? I ain't seen much television lately. It happened late in the night on Christmas Eve. That's so, Christmas Eve? A man on the boat was shot. Did you see anything? Uh, well, let me see. 
A uh, boat, you say? I reckon I might have seen one. Uh, not sure, though. <laughs> oh, gotta remember, but I've been watching this here lake for a good three days now. I've seen enough boats to choke a meal. <laughs> kind of hard to remember where, where, which I've seen when. So, okay, so did the murder happen at 12.15 on the 24th, or did it have, happen at 12.15 on the 25th? I don't know which it is. I think, um... I think it might be the 24th. But that's still a long time for an autopsy, right? A day and a half? When, was 12.15 when they got the call, or when the bullet was fired? I forget that's when we spoke to Gumshoe. That's a good question, not sure. Because half an hour could have gone by. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Fair enough. Alright, a uh, lot up. So, what is it, uh, what is it you do, Lada? Huh? Me? <laughs> Uh, you, you all don't really want to know that, do you? <laughs> Actually, I'm a research student at Country U. Uh, right in the heart of the heartland. So, a lot of heart yeah. takes pictures in the heart of Heartland. Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, that, wow, that is neat. a lot of heart. Yeah. Nick, she's a research student at a university, Country U. He's standing there, uh, you can hear. So I hear. Yeah, I saw it. <laughs> <laughs> so, when did you come up here? Let me see, I guess it was about three days ago? What are you photographing? <laughs> Didn't I tell you all that already? Meteors! Yep, meteor showers! Falling stars? That's quite a camera you've got there. <laughs> Y'all better know it! It's German made! Genuine Solingen? Sure, Solingen. Solen... Solingen... I don't know. Yeah. Isn't that where, Isn't they, that make where they make knives? knives? Uh, I don't know. Oh. Hmm, so what's that device you have stuck to your camera? Huh? Device? Your camera went off all by itself when I fired my party popper. Oh, that! That mic triggers the shutter whenever it detects certain sounds. It's programmed to pick up loud noises right now. A programmable camera? Neat! It says to automatically take a picture when a loud noise is detected at the face of the lake. Cool. Good to know. Um, is there anything else to scan? Oh, I guess there's... This camera is rigged to respond to noise. It only responds to loud noises, like a party popper. And somehow didn't go off when she was screaming a lot. Like, Is the, is the camping set hers, or does the camera set hers? I think both. They're, they're both. Because if she, left, if she left the camera there, I don't know, maybe went to do a Wii or something. Yes. Bunch of, bunch of, like... Yes, people. this camera should have picked it up. Assuming yeah, assuming the people, boat is yeah. actually like within shot, yes, it should have seen it. Yeah. Well, and like if I'm just imagining she goes to do do, do something like take a wee or something or whatever, I don't know what. And then some people who we've not met yet decided to go camping. They put their stuff there, have some champagne or whatever, you know, party poppers. Yeah, uh. Merry Christmas. Not knowing, and then it sets the camera off, and it's maybe that's what happened. Maybe maybe it's not her gear. Maybe it's just the camera that's her gear. I don't know. Uh, we will we'll find out, I guess. Yeah. Um. So we're gonna move back because I think we've got everything from her for now. But... We need to take a samurai dog to the to the case. It's it's evidence. Boat rentals. <laughs> what do we got here? Nick, what is this place? Boat rental shop. Close to Christmas, it seems. I guess a murder taking place on one of the boats won't be good for business either. Boats? I've never ridden on a boat. Turns out the bellboy has switched careers. I work in boat rentals now. This oh. boat is going to be our pride and joy. Yes, I, you, as you say, sir, strike while the iron's hot. Really? Well, how about we go out on, on, on one when the trial is finished? Okay, good idea. You bet. Right, well, let's take a look. Boat rentals. A small boat rental shop. Doesn't look like anyone is around. They're probably closed because it's Christmas. Uh, I can look at trees. There's more forest off that way. I doubt I'd find any helpful clues in there. Here's boats. There are some boats floating at the dock. Is one of the boats used in the murder, I wonder? Nick? Huh? I changed my mind. I don't really want to go for a boat ride. Okay. <laughs> well, 
She's scared of um, Gordy or something. Yeah, maybe. Or being murdered on the lake, one of those. I was planning on it, it's true. Um, I don't think there's anything else. I will quickly go back to the woods just in case something's changed. I don't think it has. Yeah, there's no reason for it um, to have changed, but yeah, I think uh, I think we need to go see Gumshoe. That's our next move. Um, entrance. Yeah. So. Yeah, I'll go. I'll go see. Uh, see him. Oh my gosh. What is that alien? <laughs> it's pretty good. I'm the Christmas alien. <laughs> like, what is that thing? <laughs> it looks like a villain in Klonoa. <laughs> yeah, it does look kind of yeah. That poster in the middle is it in a movie? Uh, no. It's I, like a policewoman, or is it? Yeah, like well, a it, it is a policewoman. I, I suspect it's probably like a like a their police like campaign like poster that they probably have around the city. I would oh, imagine. Okay. Looks like Detective Gumshoe isn't here. Um, uh, who's going to be the chief? Something wrong, miss? Hmm. Turning yourself in? What? what? Okay. What do you do? Shoplifting? Larceny? Public indecency? No. None of those things. We're looking for Detective Gumshoe. Is he around? Gumshoe? Oh, uh, yeah. He's in a meeting right now. I don't think he'll be out anytime soon. Okay, we'll come back. You do that. Oh, and go straight home and stay out of trouble. The, the, the chief no more is mental. <laughs> no more shoplifting. You got that? Do I look like a criminal or something? You do not. No. He, if that's the chief, he's unhinged. This must be the chief of the detectives here. He's glued to his computer screen. What? Gord Lake? <laughs> Gordy cited? I don't believe <laughs> he believe he Do chooses you think something more important. Yeah. Gordy shot dead. No! <laughs> yes! The bastards! Hey, is that the police department's mascot? <laughs> That's the <laughs> Badger, oh my it is God. not. <laughs> that uh, is, is not what a badge? badger looks like. You know, a bat. No, it's it's badge. like a police, police badge. badge. Yeah, okay. That's it why it's got the, pop, yeah. the spikes on it. Yeah, the actually, blue okay. badger. That's pretty good. Uh, I believe he's called Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> it was my idea. I made it. It's my mascot. I see. How nice. I'll get him assigned a mascot of the Criminal Affairs Department if it's the last thing I do. When they're in the interrogation room, this one is the one who will go in to interrogate. <laughs> Good luck. I believe you. Post from a female police officer. Wait, no, that's the latest babes in uniform calendar. My bad. Oh, okay. I, I gave I gave that poster too much credit. <laughs> I I also did. I was like, oh, that, this must be a progressive police station. But they're like, I, I was like, oh, it's a movie, and you no. were like, yeah. <laughs> like, no, no, no. This this dude's just horny as fuck. <laughs> These are the detectives' desks. There are computers and files in each one. Funny, they're a lot tidier than I'd expect. I guess the detectives don't spend a lot of time at their desks. You know the laptop on the right? Yeah. So every police drama or like worth it. So even like dramas and like on or like documentaries, they always have a ThinkPad mm. or some serious looking laptop. And that's why I swear by my ThinkPad. I always tell everyone that like, this is the, this is a serious man's laptop. I know that this game was made in 2001, but that is a thick laptop. Yeah. Also, the keys no, are tiny. Me. <laughs> also, why is why is the numpad on the left? Yeah, that is. A... I hate it. <laughs> I hate this laptop. <laughs> also, it's like long. Yeah, it's really long. The, the keys are so small. They're so small. Like I could fit a f like my pinky over four characters. Like I hate it. It must be one of the detectives He's mumbling something to himself. Yeah, man, I could see you know she'd be crying. <laughs> okay. Break and spit it out, you low-life scumbag. God, it is a dodgy. 
You must be doing image training for interrogations. Alright. Um, move, I guess. Uh, let's go see Edgeworth. Nothing? D d did you do it? <laughs> Edgeworth, this is really hard for me to ask, but you didn't do it, right? Right? Um, think what you will. I have only one request. Huh? Stay out of this case. Why? But, but Nick is trying to help you. I know. I know that. But I don't want your help, okay? Why not? Look, just go away and leave me alone. Mr. Edgeworth mm. did it. Maya, let's go investigate elsewhere. But... Nick... He did not do it. I refuse to believe. Okay, so where do I need to go... For... Like, things to trigger? Like, something will trigger somewhere... New. Where is it? So, Dick Gumshoe's not in the office. Yeah, I couldn't speak to him. Can I talk to you about anything else? I present the camera, like what happens? Oh, present the camera to, um, <coughs> Edgeworth? Jesus Christ, Edgeworth? sorry. Um, I could try that. Uh, Lada? Yeah? So, your camera. It triggers on loud explosion noises. Here. Yeah. Actually, the victim in this case we're researching, he was shot with a pistol. A pistol? Right. Now, wouldn't a gunshot make a similar noise to our party popper? I guess it would. Your camera didn't get a picture of the murder, did it? Hey! Y'all look pretty bright! Huh? I see what you're saying. I'll tell you what, I'll have a look see at my film. It would have been a photo taken late last night. I just... Last night? What? It's confusing because oh, it's like... When is about, it? Are you, are you talking about the morning? Oh, when or is it? It's, yeah, like... I don't know! It makes more sense to be Christmas morning because it was breaking news that it happened and they haven't got the autopsy report yet because it's only been, like, say, 12 hours. Like, that's not enough time. I get it. That makes more sense. But the way it's phrasing, I don't know! <laughs> yeah. I checked him once and don't remember if there's anything on him, though. But, uh, what if I got something? I could be a witness to a genuine murder! Yeehaw! I'll go check that film. Y'all come back now, you hear? Okay, great. <laughs> what was that magic trick? Did you yeah. see that? <laughs> she went inside her SUV. I guess we should come back later. Okay. Um, <coughs> did we still... Okay, we still have a camera. Cool. Um, right, so we'll be back in a bit, I guess. Let's go to... I wonder if uh, Gumshoe will be out now. Yes, he is. Okay, good. You love to see it. Oh, I guess the gumshoe was still in that meeting. Hey. Thanks for coming down, pal. Detective Gumshoe? Sorry, I read that wrong. Detective Gumshoe! We should, uh, we just finished the Why did you say my name twice? Anyway, <laughs> we just finished the meeting, for better or for worse. I got a feeling we're in for some bad news. Alright, go on. Do you know anything about the victim yet? No, no, still can't ID him. Has Mr. Edgeworth said anything? Not a word. Okay, the meeting. So, how did the meeting go? I can't tell you, pal. You're a lawyer. It's true. You know... I don't know what to believe anymore. Sure, Mr. Edgeworth's human like you or me. Still, I get the feeling that if he'd done something wrong, he wouldn't go hiding it. That's just the kind of guy he is. Why can't anyone else see that? Do they think that Mr. Edgeworth did it? Well, the trial's starting tomorrow, as scheduled. I see. Um, hey, in the end, you did tell us about the meeting. 
Huh. In the end, yeah. Don't, don't go telling anyone else, pal. I I, I misread like I read that wrong. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Then do me a favor. Stand by, Mr. Edgeworth. He needs help, and you're the ones to help him. I'm sure he's got some reason why he won't talk to us. Thanks, Detective Gumshoe. All right, trusting as both. Detective Gumshoe, how come you trust Mr. Edgeworth so much? Well, I think that was obvious. We've got a strong working relationship, us two. We trust each other, and that's how it works. A working relationship? See, Mr. Edgeworth always gets his defendants declared guilty every time. Yeah, his methods might be a little extreme at times, but there's a reason. He trusts our investigation, see? He trusts... Oh, what, did you hear that? Yeah, I did, yeah. Sorry, my dog dropped a toy. That's okay. Uh, he, he trusts us to get the right man. That scared me, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it triggered Lotta's camera. It was so loud. <laughs> yeah, she's got a picture of my dog. Right. That's why I work extra hard, pal. We've got to earn that trust he places in us. I see. Mr. Edgeworth is a man you can trust. And you have my word on that. Autopsy report. I was wondering, did you ever get that autopsy report? Oh, that? Yeah, I made a copy for you. Oh, thank you. Sometime on the 24th or 25th. Okay, so it Thanks. did happen. Yeah. It did happen this morning at like... 12.15 or like 11.45 or something, like, roughly. Okay, good. One bullet shot to the heart. That is a very, <laughs> very... And in parenthesis it says, and you're to blame. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you give love a bad name. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Nick? Huh? Can you show me that photo of the victim? Huh, okay. <laughs> what if it was like the Chad face? I don't know. <laughs> that face. Someone you know? I don't know. I just have this feeling that I met him somewhere a long time ago. Okay, interesting.